What the fuck? You good? I started. Huh? Also, I realized something. Oh, wait, mm -hmm. did you already do it? What, do you have to? Yeah. Yeah. Alright, one, two, three, begin. Yeah. Fucking. Why? Where the fuck am I? Why am I on an orange bed? Where the hell am I? Why is my head fucking hurt? Jesus Christ. Uh, hell. Uh, feel, did I get knocked out or something? I feel like I got knocked out. Um, tattered scroll. Um, what are these? Oh, yeah, they're labels. Wait a minute. Wait. I'm slow. Wait, where the fuck is my armor? Wait, do I, um, did, did I at least get... Okay. The small... Okay. My magic bane's still here. Okay. That's good. Okay. The small knife is still where I hid it. Um, so all my weapons are gone. Okay. So, okay. Think about this logically. So, you got knocked out. And someone probably knocked you out and brought you here. So, let's just try and be quiet. Sneak around like how you did at Fabrica and Alchemia's little hideout. And just try and be quiet. Where would they have hidden my shit? They hide in her. This is a bunch of food. This is a bunch of food. Don't mind if I, don't mind if I do take some of that. Okay, um, sorry, inner conscience went off for a minute. Um, steal some of that. Steal some of the ice cream here. Okay. Ooh, tea. Nope, stop getting distracted. Stop getting distracted. Okay. Ooh, that's a pretty fountain. Ooh, that's a nice fountain. I like it. Oh, look, there's a pretty flower in there. Uh, I like that. You know what? I'm going to steal that idea for my own house, actually. Christine needs to get distracted. Okay. Um... Like, uh, coal. Oh, I still have, oh, I still have my cherry wine on me. Okay. No, mind if I do. Apparently I'm not thirsty. Uh, don't mind if, you know, if they steal my stuff, I'm gonna steal their stuff right back. Okay. What's in here? Fuck! Yes, my shit! Okay. Fuck. Okay. Um, alright. Fuck, my head still hurts. My head still fucking hurts. Jesus Christ. You know, you know, we might get to. You know, if I find the person who knocked me out and put me here, I might, you know, you know, I actually, that's a consideration. Murder is a consideration that I will take into account depending on who it took me here and why they put me here. Okay, but I got all my stuff, all my weapons. Um, actually, let me... Okay. But, since they're not home, I don't really want to risk that, so I'm just going to get out of this house. And, of course, it's still raining. You know, yeah, make an example out of them. I like that. I, I kind of want to check out their fountain, though. Let's check out their fountain here. Ooh. You know, you know, even though they kidnap, even though someone kidnapped me, I appreciate the fountain. I appreciate this fountain out here. Like, gotta give them some credit. 
Jesus, why am I like this? Okay. Let's, okay. Um, now where the hell am I and where do I go? Oh, fuck. My head still hurt. Am I even now able, am I even gonna be able to get that far? Never had my head hurt like this before. Fuck. I guess let's head this direction. I get. Wait, her door open. Who's there? Don't you move another step. What that are you doing? Um, I'm obviously escaping your house, kidnapper. You got knocked out by a tree branch. I severely doubt that. You're just you just want me to come over there so you can knock me out again and do whatever freaky stuff you were gonna do. What, helping you not have a concussion? Mmm, I truly doubt that's that, that was your intent of keeping me here. Sure, okay, welcome from a swamp in the rain. What was that? Sure, welcome in the swamp from the rain. You're you're literally in the swamp and it's raining. You know, yeah. Yeah, I kind of came out here looking for someone. And then you kind of... Who were you looking for? Well, basically, a chef from East Haven told me about a person who lives in a swamp with the... What do you, what do you say? Ginger hair? Yeah? Yeah, you, that's probably me. Oh, that's you? Okay, then I'll put this away then. What, what did you have there? Uh, flux bolt. The fuck is a flux bolt? You don't know anything about Thonecraft, do you? Oh, you're one of those, okay. One of those? Make that sound I'm like a bad thing. I'm not entirely a fan of Thonecraft. I mean, you took a lot of my items off me. I think that should have been kind of obvious from the stuff you took off. I've never seen Thomcraft things before. Fair enough. Um, ah, my head starts. No, really, you got hit by a tree branch. I would very much think your head would still hurt. I still am very doubtful that I got hit by a tree branch. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be real. I have literally no capability to knock you out. You'd be surprised. Like tiny, tiny people and. Tiny people can be very strong. My head's still not thinking right. I, sure. Can you want to come back inside or? Yeah, sure. I like your fountain, by the way. I thank you. I I, I really like your fountain. It's very nice. Also, I since you're not an enemy, I guess here head. Why did you, okay. You took my stuff, so I thought I'd take yours. Okay. I understand the good apples. Why why did you take the ice cream? Because it's a flavor I like. You can have some. Oh, okay. Here I'll take off my sustainer so I can um eat. The hell is a sustainer? Oh, uh, basically, it's a um, Thomcraft pendant thing where basically it um, makes it so you can never starve. Huh. Okay, then. It's very useful. Like, here, here. Like, here. Like, uh, just, uh, like, put it in your... Uh, just put it on. I... Okay. Oh. You see? Huh. Yeah. That is interesting. Alright, now, now, yeah, I kind of need that. That's the only one I have. <laughs> yeah, I, d I don't particularly want to keep it. Fair enough. Yeah, I mean, also, out of all the places you could live, why are you living out in a swamp? Um, I have my reasons. And those reasons are to kidnap 
random people you find in the swamp who are knocked out to bring into your house? It's not really kidnapping if you're not a kid, first of all. Fine. Adult napping. Sounds even worse. That's the point. That's why no one calls it adult napping. <laughs> a fatter, I guess? I'm not particular on how people speak, so I don't know. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah, no, the, yeah, yeah, you know, anyways, I'll just, I'll, I'll just put this back. Okay, then. Yeah, I mean, uh, you got any more tea? Uh, yeah. I'm just... What flavor do you like? Uh, do you got, uh, do you got, a? What was it like? Um, what's 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 my? It's it's the pink one. Raspberry or chai. Uh, it, it's like the very. It's like the bright pink. It usually comes out like bright pink. Probably this. Yeah, kind of. I'm gonna sit down. Yeah, my head still hurts. What you? No, really. Yeah. I think your head would still hurt from getting hit by a tree branch, which I still don't even know how that happened. Well, basically, the story, I, if I believe that I was hit by a tree branch and you didn't just hit me over the head with one, um... I cannot pick up a tree branch! It's not... how... how I think anyone can pick up a tree branch, if I'm be real. That... Uh, you know, a giant one. True. Well, basically, the story is I picked up a chef from East Haven. Uh, he was telling me some stories. He told me about you, a customer who he was, who he said, came into the um, restaurant with occasionally different animal features. I got curious. He told me you smelled like you lived in a swamp, so I swam here. And swimmer? Yeah, I'm a very fast swimmer. I... Okay, then. And then I was uh, traveling the muddy, rainy swamp. Honestly, a swamp while it's, while, it's, while it's been raining for days on... for months on end is terrible. Yeah, no, really. I definitely wouldn't need that. You know, yeah, fair. You do live here. I don't... Why don't you just live in East Haven? I don't want to. Why not? It's like a, it's a great city. I mean, I go there occasionally to buy things, but I don't want to live there. Mm, I guess fair. I mean, to be fair, even that bird, even that bird, swan, animal left East Haven, so something's probably going on there. I would not know. Fair. Yeah. <laughs> but you're curious about animal thoughts? Oh, uh, yeah, because um, Jason told me that you um, occasionally switched your animal features. Well, my favorite is fawn. Oh. You just... Well, yeah, I can just turn it off and on. Well, switch it. I don't think turn off and on is the right... Yeah. ...term for that. Yeah. How do you do that, exactly? Morphology. What the fuck is morphology? It's a kind of magic... Or alchemy, I guess, would be more accurate. And it allows you to... Get traits of animals. Huh. Ah, oh, that's interesting. So it basically just allows you to become an animan, but multiple animans? I mean, you can't really become an animan because it doesn't become part of your DNA. I guess, yeah. 
I mean, you'd still be a human. Yeah. Huh. I guess that makes sense. I mean, I don't know. I guess that makes sense why you have so many labels in your room. Because there's uh, yeah. labels. Yeah. Well, there, there are many things that can happen with morphology, and I wouldn't want to drink the wrong one. What can go wrong, exactly? Well, when you get animal parts, it's going to, you know, shape it around your body. Say if you got the cat tail, it's going to extend your spine, and that's going to hurt. Mm -hmm. If you drink ones that aren't compatible, you could get stuck like that in immense pain. That doesn't sound good. No, it doesn't. Although... Almost on the level of how bad Thumbcraft can go, but not as bad. I wouldn't know. Well, basically, um, your thing is more of... Well, actually, Thumbcraft can also go... Basically, it can give you both negative physical and mental effects. Well, I mean, morphology can also give you mental effects, but... That's just if you're stupid. Same with Thumbcraft, kind of. I mean, like, I mean, here, give me, which one am I? You're right, I need to make sure you didn't steal any of my money. I have plenty of my own money. Okay, good. I need that. I have, like, ten mm -hmm. endearium in my pockets. I, I have no clue where you got that, but okay. Um, it's called, um, bets, and also raiding camps. What's camps? Uh, well, and also my friend Justin gave me some as well, but, yeah. Oh, okay then. Well, basically, here, uh, let, let me just show you a couple. So basically, um, basically one of the, um, lovely things in Thumbcraft that kind of help you out a little bit is a sanity checker. A sanity checker? Yeah, basically it, um, checks the amount of warp you have in your brain. What is water? It is basically a negative thumbcraft effect that um, messes with your sanity and sometimes your physical body if you get too much of it. Huh. Like basically, let's see. I know there was a. I know there was one person I knew who was basically um, put into a room and basically had. Um, and they turned on these tubes that went into the room that just shot out a bunch of flux. And well, then that and then flux. that person flux formed. You're going to need to explain all of that because I'm not entirely sure what that means. Fair enough. Basically, uh best here, best way I'll just get the book. There's a book. Give me a minute. I'm the best person for explanations. Give me a minute. Eh, flux. Using the elements as a weapon has its benefits, but raw magic can just be as destructive. Most creatures are harmed if exposed to a raw, unfiltered viz. Even armor cannot protect you from this energy. Basically, flux is just magical energy, kind of. Okay, then. Yeah, and, I mean, my sanity's kind of down the drain a little bit, by the way. Oh, I'm just gonna... I'm fine. I haven't gone into it in months, many months. Yeah, many months. I'm still gonna be just a slight bit worried. Yeah, you're fine. It only the sanity only kind of loses my mind if I get killed a lot. I'm sorry, what? Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, I can die and come back. By the way. What? Is that a thumbcraft thing? It's a vessel thing. What is a vessel? You know, I've never had to explain that question. And I'm trying to figure out a way to explain it to where it won't break your mind. Basically, we're just uh, people who are in this world now and can die and come back. I'm not going to ask any more questions about that. I don't think I want to know the answers. Yeah, that's the best explanation, Gen. 
Fair enough, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, I mean... Also, where were you? Because you came out of your house. Why do you have a secret door behind your wall? Is this like your Because morphology... Oh. I don't particularly want anybody getting in and, you know, taking a random elixir. Oh my, this is a lot of stuff. You kind of need a lot of stuff. Something also, I wouldn't recommend going in these three. Uh, what's wrong with those three? Uh, and if you want a really bad smell, then... I already smell like swamp ground. <laughs> it's arguably worse. You know, you have a lot of ingredients here. Like, you got... You kind of need a lot of ingredients. These are vials? Yeah. Huh. A lot of stuff. Interesting. Let's see, uh, one... Huh. Oh, I like the little leaf thing you got here. Yeah, that's just more of a decorative option. Fair enough. Uh, crafting tables. Fancy. Yes, obviously. Fancy workbenches. <laughs> Fancy workbenches. I get to have something nice. Fair enough. I mean, to be fair, you are wearing, like, very nice clothes, I know we'll say that. Thank you. No problem. Also, forgive me for not asking. What's your name, by the way? Selakura. Selakura. Or Sel for short, as many people find it hard to pronounce my name. I'll try out Selakura for a little bit. Alright. Uh, what is your name? Uh, Chris. That's much easier than mine. <laughs> nah, not here I'll elongate it. Um, Chris Kura. <laughs> that... <laughs> what? <laughs> Chris Kura. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, I, I can definitely see that your insanity is just a little bit down there. <laughs> nah, that wasn't funny to you. <laughs> well, come on, it was a little humorous. Come on. You, you, come on, laugh a little bit. Come on. Come on, I... laugh. But... What? Come on, that was funny. Come on. I, I guess if you consider that funny, I'm not entirely sure why that's funny. Fair enough. What's your sense of humor? I... I don't really know. I don't talk to people on a daily basis. You, you don't know your sense of humor? I've been alone for a while. How long have you been I alone? Uh, since I was 14. You've been living in a swamp since you were 14? Well, technically I've been living in the swamp longer than that, but this specific part, yeah. How, how old are you? 25. Jesus. What made you want to live alone? Edict. Oh. <laughs> uh, I've killed so many of them. Um. Um. Yeah. Um. Basically, I'm part of a guild called Peacekeepers. And we fight the Edict a lot. And occasionally kill them. Well, I guess I have to thank you for that, because they killed my entire family. Oh. Yeah. Not a fan. Yeah. I mean, um... Although, unfortunately, we've occasionally had a slip-up on a few of their members. Such as... Does such as... Mean? Kane's gotten away three times. I don't think I knew him. Uh, Supreme Ritualist of Aqua. I don't know, like, the sections. Oh, fair enough. Basically, uh, there's Rowan, the leader. Right. There's the Supreme Ritualists. 
Then there's the greater ritualists. Then there's the lessers. And then there's also some loyalists in there as well. I see. They're a big organization. And we've been trying to get rid of them for so long. We took Vanguard back from them a while ago. Of course they're big. They've been a problem for a while. Yeah. I mean, to be fair, I don't exactly mind from what I've heard the old of how the old edict operated before Rowan came in. I'm not entirely sure how all that went down. I was too young. Probably not born. It's been a very long time since that. Really? I just I only know about it because I'm not of the books. Sure. I only know it because of the books. Um but yeah. Fair? And then I see me to slaughter an entire town. Yeah, uh, they're very good at that. Three towns, actually. But I repaid them a favor by slaughtering an entire camp. Two, actually. Yeah. Okay, then. To be fair, I only did that by myself, because my acquaintance, Jazzy, kind of left me for dead. But, you know. Yeah. That you that kid then. I'm more of a I'm more of a battle person more often, so you know I've kind of had to Considering the amount of weapons, yeah. Yeah. And I will say I don't like dying all that often. I don't think anyone likes dying. Not really. I mean to be fair, I mean you definitely wouldn't like dying since, well... No, 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 definitely not. Yeah, since, fortunately, you guys can only live once. Although it's... yeah. Either way, um... Mm. I'm sorry what happened to your family. That was a long time ago. At this point, I don't... Yeah. Mm. I mean, I can promise you that, uh, we'll get rid of the edicts someday. Someday. Sooner than later. I mean, we've killed a good amount of them. We only almost, and we had a chance on Kane, who's one of the worst. He's a, he's, he's a big psychopath. Aren't everyone in the Egypt a psychopath? Well, not everyone. We've redeemed a couple of their members. Okay, then. Like, we also, in Peacekeepers, we actually have a lot of Edict deserters. Huh. You'd be, know. yeah, you'd be surprised how many, um, people in the Edict leave. Not really, honestly. Fair. Hmm. Let's see. What, what exactly do you have here? Plums. Woven cotton. Poppy your mare. <laughs> here. Uh, how, how do you say this? Right. Uh, how, how do you say this one? Sorry, I threw that too far. <laughs> Papa Ham. It's, it's, it's a little hard to pronounce, but it's, you don't really need to pronounce it. Fair. Sting a fish. Yeah. You kind of know need DNA of animals to get their traits. Ooh, wait, actually, wait, wait, question, question. Yeah. Like, like, um, if if I were to go into morphology, and if I used fish, could I get gills? Um, theoretically. Yes. It's not theoretically. I've done it. Oh, how would it feel to have gills? Um, a little awkward at first. Mm-hmm. But yeah, I've I've gotten used to all kinds of animal traits. Fair, fair. Ooh, what's in here? 
Hey, don't <gasps> touch that. No. I swear if you're taking me. Oh, but it's wine. No. Yeah, that's fine. I have my own bottle. I have my own bottle of it. But I am, but I do like that you're also a cherry wine lover. No, I need that for the elixirs. You do? Yeah. I've been drinking for the past many months I've been here. <laughs> Something that's used in elixirs. Yeah. You know, it's delicious. I mean, I'm not a big person on alcohol, but kind of need it. Have you ever drunk in it? Tasted a few. I'm not particularly a fan. What about rum? Have you had rum? I'm not entirely sure, honestly. You know what? You know what? Nah, nah, so hear me out. All right. If you ever decide to um, get out of the swamp, I'm taking you drinking. Hey, are you old enough to drink? I mean, I'm, I mean, I'm 19, so. Mm, yes, like, let's go for no. Technically, I think I'm fine. Yeah, I'm still going to say no for that. <sighs> Why? For one, I don't want drink. And? Hey. What is wrong with you? What do you mean? I'm just, I just like alcohol. What do you want from me? Brain, okay. It, just, it helps my brain. It makes what me forget. So lost in insanity? And now it just, it just makes me forget things I don't want to remember. Okay. Trust me. You don't want to, you don't want to see what I've seen in my head. I don't want to see loads of things. Take it off my armor, I don't need it. Here. Here. As a... It's not Thumbcraft here. As a gift for, I guess, saving me. Oh, what is... What is a lightning knife? Uh, when you throw it, it shoots lightning. Oh. Uh. As in case you ever run to the Eater, you can, you can, uh... Strike I don't the just, you know, use my elixirs to get away. Fair. I mean, here, fine. If you don't want a weapon such as that, I can give you something less, um, less weapony. Right. Okay. Of dragon's breath could be useful for some of your elixirs if you ever want to test it. I sure. Huh? Why do you have so much? Uh, friend of mine. I'm concerned of what friend that is. Um, he is a nerd. Uh, okay then. He's part of a guild called the Library of the Lions. They're basically just knowledge seekers. Huh. Okay, then. And he does a lot of thumbcraft, though I'm better than him. Hey. Okay. I am. Don't question it. <laughs> um, um, I didn't particularly want to. Does your clock work? Yeah. Seem like it's moving. I mean, it's old. I guess. Huh. What are you doing? Cleaning your mirror. Okay. 
I don't know. I'm just trying to get to know more about you. I mean, I'm probably going to be here for a bit. <laughs> I, okay. Can't really walk in a slump with a head that starts. No, not really. To be fair, you're a nice company, so. Thank you. Yeah. Most people have said they found me annoying. Eh. I wouldn't say you're annoying. I honestly enjoy the presence, and I honestly kind of like your presence more than other people I know. I'm not sure if that's a compliment or not. Take it as a compliment. Okay, then. Because I mean it as a compliment. Okay. Also, question, where do you get the clothes? Uh, I had them. I mean, like, where'd you buy can't... them? Well, I can't really ask my mother where she got them, now can I? Ah, uh, I assumed you got it, like, when you go to East Haven or something. No. Sorry. I don't particularly like the things they have in East Haven. Fair enough. See, I kind of just came here in this. I mean, it's not a bad outfit. I mean, I like it. I mean, people think I'm a ritualist sometimes, but I like it. <laughs> Okay, then. You know, let's come for one moment. Give me a second. Uh, okay. Just gonna... Okay, there we go. Just taking off my jacket for a bit. It's gonna be hot. So I'm just... Cool. I'm just gonna go put these up. Yeah, you do that. Uh... Okay. Hmm. Where are the... Why do you have a tattered scroll in here, by the way? Uh, I don't know, something cool I found. I'm gonna take this from you. Hey. Why? Uh, well, um, it gives you warping five. Oh. It's basically a Thomcraft item. It's one of the more dangerous ones. I used them at one point and it kind of messed up my mind for a bit. Okay, then. Just saving you from that. <laughs> Thank you? I'd rather not um, have to <laughs> deal with the sanity thing. You know? Sure. I'm not gonna question that. Oh. Question, am I too weird? Um, I'm not the pers person to gauge that. Okay, am I weird to you? A little bit. Why am I weird to you? Uh, um, oh. I don't, I, I, don't, I don't know why you expect me that to have a very specific answer. I don't really know you. We literally just met. Well, no, I just mean, like, I'm just trying to ask, like, what's off-putting about me, because I notice you have a lot of like, I notice your, uh, whole, uh, what's the word? What? I'm trying to figure out the word. Give me a minute. Okay. I don't know, you just seem very confused. <laughs> I am. What are you confused about? A lot of things. Such as? Pretty much 90% of what you've said. Here, I'll reiterate it. Um, tell, tell me, what are you mostly confused about? I will re-answer a more... Um, Logical way. What are you? I don't know if that's necessary. Okay. Uh, 
Anyways, okay. I mean, if you say it's not necessary, that's fine. I really like your fountain. Why do you like my fountain so much? I, I just, I like it. Like, there's the pink flower in the middle, the white blocks around it, the niters, the leaves. I like it. Oh, those are niters? Yeah. Which farmer shop? Makes the sense. Ones? They sell very well. I have a lot of blue ones around my tower. Well, if you haven't noticed, my color is kind of, you know, brown. Brown, orange, yeah. Ooh, I yeah. like the banner. You just not noticed the banner. Yeah. Where'd There's you get two... Guest. Ah, uh, fair enough. It's pretty pretty. I like it. Thank you. No problem. I don't know, I just, I enjoy it. Ooh. What? Sorry, I just now noticed the white tulip. <laughs> you are not very observant, are you? Uh, a little reminder, I have a concussion, lady. <laughs> Fair, but still. That's probably why I keep. That's probably why I keep re-saying things. <laughs> I would hope you don't do that normally. I don't normally do it. Me sure. I'm more usually I'm quieter. I guess. Okay. Like usually I'm more quiet. Don't really talk that much around unless I'm around people I actually trust and like. Fair? When I'm around other people, I kind of just stay silent unless I'm referred to. And then I just do what I'm told. Don't most people do that? I guess. I don't know. Okay. Then again, also, I mean, I don't know. I just feel very, like, I don't know. Ever get the feeling like ever get the feeling like you're uh not that like useful or anything? No. No, you never had that feeling? I mean I don't entirely know what you mean. Like ever get the feeling like I'm um, like uh not much of a change if you never were like around or anything. I mean, the only one I would affect is myself, so like I don't know how I can feel like that. Fair. I don't know. There's not too many people who get some stuff I think about. And also, more people disliked me more since I kind of went to Thomcraft. I mean, I don't know why you would specifically judge someone on Thomcraft. I'm not a fan, but I'm not judging you for it. Mostly of what I've done in it. I mean, you don't really make one of these. What is that? Primal Cutter. Basically, it's a voidal weapon. Or basically, I mean, to make it, you kind of have to delve into warp, which affects your sanity. Which, yeah, people aren't very fond of. I mean, I can see why. Yeah. But I have my reasons for doing it. But some people don't get that. I mean, you have a reason, I guess, and you're not hurting yourself too much. I mean, my reasoning was to, well, help more people effectively. That's pretty good reason. Because, you know, I mean, I was one of the weaker members of Peacekeepers, then I delved into this stuff, and now I'm one of the stronger members of it. Nice. Yeah, but I still don't get any recognition for it. I mean, to the Edict, I'm only a level four, I'm only a threat level four. 
I mean, I'm sure the edict has probably seen a lot of things that don't find you very impressive. Mm. Well, once we managed, once I am part of managing to get rid of them, there's not going to be anything for them to be impressed by since they'll all be gone. Okay. Probably. I mean, to be fair, we mostly just need to kill their leader, Rowan. It's, the way you said that just sounded very ominous. Fair enough. I mean, fair enough, I guess. The Rankos? What? I mean, we're kind of underneath an ether hang. Fair. So, it's a my not gonna see the rain very much. No, I mean, the, everything went quiet for a moment. I mean, rain doesn't continuously go, it spurs. Yeah, I, I don't know, I just wasn't expecting it to go quiet. I'm used to a lot of rain, it's a swamp. True, so technically this isn't that much of a change for you, to be fair. Not really. Fair enough. You know, I can respect it. I mean, I don't even mind the rain. To be fair. The only thing I, you know, don't like is my cloak getting wet. You can, you can dry it off. Well, I mean, yeah, I can take it off, but like... Yeah. Then... Yeah. Anyways, um, hmm. You can drink this tea or no? I, you can have it, I guess. Okay. I don't, I don't know. I don't know, it was, just, it was sitting here when I woke up. It's like just here. I, well, yeah, I didn't honestly expect you to wake up that soon. When did you expect me to wake up? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how concussions really work. You know, fair enough, honestly. I've never had a concussion, so we're in the same boat there. I'm surprised by that. Surprised I've never had a concussion? Yeah. Why are you surprised by that? Considering when I got there, it looked like you had, like, hit the tree beforehand. Yeah. <laughs> you know, the more my brain clears up, the more that action makes sense to me. I... Why? Um, well, I think <laughs> what happened was I got angry, so I shot a flux bolt at the tree. Why would you do that? Because I was mad that I didn't know where I was, so I had to take it out on something. <laughs> you are on the fault for going into a damn swamp when it's raining. Well, when else am I gonna go? The rain hasn't stopped for months. What do you expect? <laughs> not, not go into a swamp? Well, my curiosity made me want to find you, so I did it. <laughs> There were so many easier ways of getting to me than doing that. And that easier way is? There's literally a path over the mountains over there. That you, if you just like went around, it would have been so much easier. Well, I don't know where your house was. Because I like the overhead. Again, I didn't know where your house was. <sighs> It's, but there's, there's, there's a path right there. Not, okay. So here's how it went, all right? Okay. Hmm. So basically, okay. So I didn't know this path existed. Basically, what happened was, I went for my tower. I immediately started swimming. So I came into the swamp at a random direction. And yeah. 
How did you know which direction to go? Well, I knew where the swamp was. I just didn't know where um, the house was. I'm not that far into the swamp. I was not aware of that fact. Jason told me shit. I don't think he knew. Yeah. It's not like he asked. I mean, all he knew was swamp lady, so... Sounds very insulting. Well, that's not... Well, you can talk back to Jason when you see him. I... Okay? Yeah. Then again, I don't think you're ever gonna leave the swamp. If you haven't left it in that many years, you're doubtful to leave it. Well, you know, considering the fact that you didn't follow me into the swamp when they attacked, I, you know, it's kind of a safe place for me. I truly doubt they care about you anymore at this point. Honestly, we've kind of taken their main attention. I'm fair. Because, you know, once we've literally encountered their one of their supreme ritualists three times, took back an entire city from them, um, fought them off on many occasions, killed some of their camps. I think we've kind of taken their main interest. <laughs> Just a little bit. Just a little bit, you know? Just a little bit. Yes. So, I mean, honestly, you could probably leave this area, honestly. Well, I don't particularly have another place to go, so... I mean... And I'd also have to move all of my morphology things. Which True. would take forever. True. I mean, if you ever did want to move out, I mean, I can always return the favor for you to save my life and help you move it. I'm fast, so... I definitely haven't noticed that. Like here, I just put my boots on. I where the f where did you go? Oh there. Huh. Oh yeah, so fun thing. So I got my boots as a traveler, so speed also. Cool. It's that's not very impressive to me. Yeah, that is. Here, uh. Can you, like, not do that? I forgot that was the ice one. How did you forget? I can put the lily pad back. <laughs> I kind of forgot that was the ice one. How? Here, um, we'll, we'll go put the lily pad back. Okay. Okay, um, uh, let me... Alright, this is the one I meant to shoot. What does that do? Fire flux cloud spell. How about don't shoot that near a wooden house? It won't burn. Yes, it will. See, it's fine. It, these don't spread fire. Don't care. I've shot it at my house many times. It's your own problem. Don't shoot at other people's fucking houses. True. Fair enough. Sorry about your house. Uh, is the fire gone? I. Yeah. Yeah, it's gone. Why would you jump in it? Because I can respawn. <laughs> yeah, I keep forgetting that fact. Like here, literally. Here, wait. Give me a minute. I. What are you doing? I'm gonna die real quick. I, what? What do you mean? Why? 
You know, good point. Actually, you know what? I'd rather you not see me die, actually. And I'd also I rather not I... burn to death. Um, I don't particularly want to see somebody kill themselves. Yeah, fair enough. I mean, it wouldn't be the first time, but I've accident but I accidentally did it on that occasion. I you What? You are a child. Eh, not really. I landed wrong. Yeah, yeah you did. There we go. What were you trying to do? There we go. Okay. Perfect. Um, ooh, actually, there's another thing to show you. Give me a minute. So, so, hear me out, hear me out. Okay. Do you know what this is? No. Bada boom. Cool. I don't know. I just like playing with that. Hmm. Well, either way. Yeah, sorry about your house. Um. Yeah. I didn't actually mean to hit it. I kind of meant to aim here. <laughs> to fight or something. I honestly, need to, I honestly need to fix that problem. Yeah. I mean, literally, I woke up, and instead of assuming that somebody took me in to keep me safe, I assumed um, you kidnapped me and tried to escape. <laughs> if somebody kidnapped you, I don't think they'd take you to their house. I didn't know it was your house at first. It's a normal looking house. What? It doesn't look like a base or anything. Fair enough. What are you doing? Looking into the fountain. Okay. Mm, you know what I could use? Like, you know, like, how some fountains, like, have, like, a little, like, ceramic head, like, at the top here? Yeah. I think it'd look nice with that. It's not meant to be, like, a fountain fountain. It's for, right. it's to get fresh water. Oh, it's for like, fresh water. Yeah, because, you know, I need it. Or, you know, yeah, you're how long has it been since I've drinking anything, but oh. Right. That's concerning. I mean then again, I don't have to actually drink anything. Right. Okay. I don't know. I'm just I'm still confused as how to how I'm like I'm like I, I understand how I may have gotten hit by a tree branch, but I still like tree branch got me like yeah like out of all the things that I've fought in in my life a tree branch got me I d you expect me to explain how you get knocked out by a tree branch I guess I can't really explain that I don't know it's like it's mainly because, like, I fought an edict members in a tree branch. I don't know. Maybe you should hit the tree. Fair enough. Here. Ooh, wait. I know what I want to do. Follow me. Okay. I, I have to do something. I think I was, like... Do you know where you found me? It was that way. 
Oh, it was that way? Alright, lead the way. Okay. Yeah, I, I think that I, I think I dropped something there, so um, I kind of need to grab it. What did you drop? I didn't... Okay. I don't know. I just, I just noticed it didn't have something, so I just want to... I, okay, I don't... And I don't know where I fell, so... It was a little ways over here. Alright. I mean, if you looked like you were heading the other direction, literally, if you had just turned around, you would have been fine. Yeah, true. Okay, well, that's annoying. You good? Yeah. Oh, you're wet. <laughs> er. <laughs> you're wet, er. <laughs> yeah, I was already a little bit wet from, you know, the rain. Yeah. What? Here, I got this. Step back. What? Why? Oh. Uh, I'm gonna get us an ice bridge. Alright. Okay. That didn't work. No, no, it did not. Okay, now wait for the fire to go away. Yeah. Well, while you do that. Oh. Did I hear you sip something? Uh, I might have, I might have hit it a little bit. I heard you sip something before the wings happened. Yeah, I drank an elixir. Huh. Well, anyways, keep going. Okay. How long does that last? Uh, till I drink the reversal. Huh. Okay. I don't feel like drinking it right now. Fair. Because I kind of... I need the wings. I'm not very... Can't fly very well, but it helps. True, true. I normally really hover. I'm not... Yeah. I'm not that good with the wings. Yeah, you're not really... Better. Yeah, you're not really like my acquaintance who's an angel, so... You know an angel? Yeah, her name's Cam. Okay. She's a vessel like me. Okay, then. And then I also have a swan animan friend. Well, obviously, he can fly very well. He was born with wings. Yeah. I don't really tamper with the wings too much. So many orchids. I like it. All right. Oh yeah, orchids are nice. I think you were like here. All right, here? Okay, okay. Which is the tree that had the branch on it? That one. Fuck you, tree. <laughs> okay. All right, we can go now. Why? Why did you want to do that? Revenge. <laughs> Into the tree? Yes, exactly. <laughs> Don't worry, you the rain will put it out. <laughs> you are seriously crazy. Oh, come on. You never wanted revenge on something that harmed you. No, because I'm not stupid. I wouldn't say I'm stupid. But I'm definitely not as smart as you. So. Um, considering the fact I have to remember all the... Freaking elixirs, yeah, I think I'd be pretty smart. Exactly, you're smarter than me. I'm still older than you, so that probably helps a little bit. Eh, not that older. Eh. You're not that much older than me. I mean, five year difference, yeah. Yeah. I think I can see your house from here, so, uh... Yeah, again, I can't fly all too well, so... I can't fly I can, at all. You know, me have a... I will say, flying would be dope. Uh, you realize how hard wings are to conjure? 
Don't worry, chat, we got your arson. What? Don't worry about it. Okay, I'm just gonna quickly... Yeah, you do whatever you're doing. There we go. Nice. I see. You only got the... It only reversed the wings. Interesting. Yeah. Huh. Interesting. Hmm. Interesting. I don't know. This morphology intrigues me a bit. <laughs> it seems very useful. I mean, nobody's really asked me about it before. Hmm. How did you learn it? What do you what do you think? Or more of how did you discover what it? What do you think? Uh, that's a long story. And I am basically immortal. I can listen. I mean I kinda of found like an ill book somewhere um saying something about it. It really only explained the basics and I found their lot out by experimenting. Mm -hmm. Which both is good and bad because that caused a lot of pain. Yeah. Yeah. I see. Luckily, I was younger, so oh, my yeah. body not setting properly yet was actually better. Uh huh. Uh huh. I see. Didn't mm. hurt as much. Do you still have this book? Um, I don't have the exact book that I found, but I wrote my own with mixers and things. Ooh, could, could you, could you, uh, a strange question. Can you teach me how to do morphology? I, I mean, I could. I'm a fast learner. I find that hard to believe. Oh, you would imagine. <laughs> You'd be surprised how fast I got through this. You'd be surprised how fast I learned. Well, doesn't Thumbcraft have, like, you know, very specific instructions? Yes. Morphology does not. I'm okay with that. I mean, okay. I, have, I mean, I have you, who is probably a great teacher, to tell me what I'm doing wrong. I think the pain that you'd feel would tell you that you did something wrong. Either way, you have a point there. And hear me out. I mean, if anything ever goes wrong and it kills me, I can just come right back. Would killing you reverse permanent effects? That's a good question. I don't know. I'm both curious and don't want to find out. I also don't really want to find out, if I'm going to be real. It's already bad enough to get permanent effects. Yeah, it'd be kind of bad if I could die and I still have those effects, honestly. But either way... Yeah, I mean, it really won't... But either way, I don't worry. I, I won't do anything bad. Sure you will. I'm a great student. And also, I have my own apprentice. I know how to, I know how to teach. Are you learning how to teach and learning are two different things. Well, you can apply your abilities of teaching to learning. Sure. That's what I've learned. I... Sure, sure. I mean, you want to know the best way to teach your students? Sure. Basically, I have this one rule with my apprentice. Um, it's called learning on the job. Okay, then. It's very lovely. Very lovely. Nice. I mean, do you want to do that? I guess you could. Probably not with morphology. <laughs> probably not with morphology. That'd probably be bad. Probably learning on the job with that is probably not going to end well. No. <laughs> From what you've no. told me, anyways. No. 
I got very lucky. <laughs> Fair enough. Either way, will you teach me or will you not? I... I mean, if you want to learn that badly, I wouldn't mind. Yeah, I mean, you could use more company here. I mean, must suck being alone all the time. I mean, a little bit. Exactly. And now you have a very, um... idiotic person to keep you company. Yeah, that, that's definitely the word. Yeah. Energetic. Energetic's not the word. Handsome. That's a joke. Yeah, I'm not responding to that one. Why not? <laughs> I don't. I, I first of all, I'm not a judge of that. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you know I'm just kidding, all right? You know I'm kidding. I, do I? I am. Okay. Uh, I, it, to be fair, I was going to make a joke of either saying handsome or ravishing. Handsome is a joke. Ravishing is just you being narcissistic. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm not really narcissistic. I just like joking that, I'm, that I am. Boosts my confidence. <laughs> Either way. Okay, then. Either way, though. Um, yeah. Well, um, hmm. All right. So how about this? Um, so, so. Yeah. I will, I will come back here, but I have to grab some stuff from my house. Okay. So I will see you when I get back. I'll be back quickly, all right? Probably with, like, within an hour. All right, I guess. All right, I'll be back. Don't worry. You won't be alone for another 14 years. Oh, that's more than 14 years. More than 14 years. Either way, I'll be back. <laughs> okay. All right, I'll head back to my house.